Mm, hello, as we can see here is the day clock I just updated and now it is used uh, updated state succeed. Okay, let's click here refresh. And then now we can see the firmware already between already become to 1040. Okay, let's click here. Here is the inverter connected to the dead clock. And this one is the inverter type 3, it means the hybrid inverter. And the rated power is 8 kilowatt, it means the 8 kilowatt the hybrid inverter. And now uh, we can, if you want to set the parameters, click here. And now, as we can see, here is a many, many, many items here. Batteries setting, system work model, grid setting, smart load, basic setting, advanced function. So many options here. And uh, here, and this. This one is the customer master command. It's used the, the remote command. Mm. Normally, for our customer, we recommend to you to them use the this the batch parameters. Okay, let's uh, click here. Read read the current parameters for the hybrid inverter. already completed we can see the battery type is the BMS lithium battery and the maximum discharge current is 185 April amps and the battery low low SOC is 15% and the float voltage is 53.6 volts yeah here is the many parameters here let's turn to another one this one system work model. Read. Okay, completed. Now the uh, hybrid inverter working model is ceiling first. Ceiling first it means uh, the solar energy and the, the excess energy will will flow will sold to the sold to the grid. And also, uh, it enables the time of time of use. There's uh, so many parameters we can see. Here's the energy, energy pattern, battery first or loader first. Here's the zero spot power. And uh, here's the time of use um, period. And the hybrid inverter, um, it has the six time periods we can, we can set for battery charging, for battery charging and the discharge. And now we can see this one, this one. 100 actually it means the uh, 1 o'clock in the morning, 1 o'clock a.m. This one is the 5 o'clock a.m. This one is the 9 o'clock a.m. This, this one is the 1 o'clock p.m. And this one is the This one is the ceiling motor time one power. It means it means in this in this time period, if the battery discharge, the maximum the maximum discharge 
discharge power of a battery is uh, um, 8000 volts and then here is for the battery SOC and the ceiling mode time, time to charge it means in this time period you can choose use the uh, grid charge or diesel generator charge here is the grid setting grid model uh, normally we choose the gen general standard and here is the grid con uh, reconnection time and here's the frequency grid type as you can see it has the uh, 220 120 um, split face and uh, 120 and three face 120 single face and here's the uh, um, grid voltage parameters here is the smart load we can define we can choose it as a um, generator input or smart load output or micro inverter input and we also can, uh, can choose the um, diesel generator input to enable or disable here is the basic setting such as the dim and the system time and uh, here is the advanced function arc setup this one is for the uh, US market and here is the DMP7 the title 